of the morning to you laddies! My name is Jacksepticeye! Uh... Okay. It's just offline mode. I guess we're not playing with other people anymore. My name is Jack Septiguy, and welcome back to Norman Reedus and his amazing fetus. We're going to continue on our story. We're exactly where we left off last time. Uh, leave private room. Yes. Oh no, it's lethal weapon. I mean, die hard. Hi. Well, have you had a chance to think it over? Chock full of Kyrelium, but safe for you Dooms guys to wear. That's all you'll need to go forth and reconnect the world. To make us whole again. I'm a porter. I don't care about connecting anything. Or making knots. But I'll do what I have to, to help Amelie out. Weird. So what is Dooms? What's Kyralium? <laughs> What's a Chiral Network? What's anything? What's a Norman Reedus? Oh, that's a Norman Reedus. Listen nice up, armpits. Sam. The terminals Amelie's people built in the towns and cities they pass through on their journey west are called knots. Ponytail time. The infrastructure's there, but the Cairo network is offline. Sexy! Now it's only capable of transmitting voice communications. Sometimes wired, sometimes wireless, and a small amount of data. So, unless the necessary data stored on site, our chirograms won't show up. Emily and the other Bridges members you've seen around the place are grams generated with local data. In case you didn't know. Anyway, I, okay. all you've got to do is find the knot, connect your cupid, and bring chiral communications online. Got it. Once you connect it to the terminal, you'll be able to initiate zero-time massive data transmission with the UCA network. And just like that, you'll reconnect us not only to each other, but to our past. <laughs> Why are you smelling it? All the lost and fragmented junk data will be compiled and restored. Like bringing a dinosaur back to life from a fossil. Okay. <clears throat> I'm glad you boiled it down with a single sentence summary at the end, because I had no idea what you were talking about. 4.6 billion years of history on Earth. All the wisdom and knowledge we lost since the Death Stranding will be ours again. And that, my friend, is how we'll beat this thing. Okay. Once you establish Cairo communications, <clears throat> generating grams won't be an issue. You'll also be able to use Cairo printers. Can I print a friend? Won't be long before we're able to send all kinds of things through the wire. Except anything original. Or that's got a soul. Nothing real. Just copies. True. Which is why we'll still need porters like you. Before and after we're made whole, we'll need men in the middle. No rest for the wicked, huh? Oh, it's baby time. It's big baby time. Yeah, well, idle hands and all that. We'll give you the details at the dispatch terminal. <clears throat> Make sure you check it upstairs. Drops waiting up there too. Aces. These shoes look like they've done some serious miles. Shall I dispose of them? Wait. Hold on. There's something I want you to look into. My blood seemed to set those things off. Happened more than once. Set them off? How do you mean? I don't know. You took my blood, didn't you? You tell me. <laughs> All right, I'll see what I can do. Hmm. Yeah, they react to his blood for some reason. Whenever the handprints would land on it, it would start sizzling. It's time to go, little baby! Oh. 
<laughs> Where's Mass? Mass Mickelson, where are you? Is that you? Wait, who's that? Yeah? Weird. Maybe they had a kid and he's a scientist and he created the bridge babies. And that's like the first one and they're all connected somehow. I don't know. I'm spitballing theories as we go. Second set of boots on me. Begin the scan. Have a pleasant journey. Sam. What? Check the terminal for available orders. Okay, I was just doing that. Available orders. Sam. Oh. This is Hardman. You didn't have a Your head for a second. The objective is to extend the Chiron network from here to Port Knot City. I don't think you can make a beeline straight forward. Signal won't carry that far. Okay. To cover the distance, we need to utilize knots. Think of it like uh, tying ropes together to make a longer rope. <laughs> the first of these knots is a bridge's way station. Go ahead and take a look at the order. Deliver whatever they need and connect the cube in. Okay. I find it hard to believe that in this super crazy future world, you somehow still have, first of all, monster energy are still around. Uh, apparently the apocalypse can't kill them. You also have a social media Cause I'm giving likes to things and everything's giving me likes. I have 666 likes right now. The devil himself. Uh, but you can't figure out how to send stuff to each other better. Nothing's automated. If you send stuff with robots, then the BTs would never show up because there's no car- whatever, I don't know. We'll see. Uh, okay, this menu is super confusing. I don't know what I'm looking at. Smart drug delivery. I'm always delivering drugs! Summaries may contain information critical to your success. Make sure to review them before getting underway. Okay, cargo condition less than 50% damage. So I'm not allowed to get more than 50% damage on the cargo. That's fine, I'm an expert drug dealer. <clears throat> okay. Uh, the focus is this delivery is condition of the car- whatever. Smart drugs, oxytocin. I'm delivering some like real shit to George. Baton. Okay, I can't be the only one who thinks that this menu system is way too complex, right? Like, I barely know what I'm looking at half the time. Okay, so I can actually put it on my back, I can attach to my suit. I have two things on my shoulders that I can attach it to. Oh, there it is right there. Uh, carry by hand or offload. No, I should carry it on my back. We've supplied you with some rope and a ladder for this run. Cool. They should help with the steeper inclines, and the ladder will also make a halfway decent bridge if you need to cross a river. Right now, I figure you're thinking about how you want to handle this order. Yes. Um, the cargo management menu can be accessed by pressing the options to access the cufflinks. It allows you to decide where and how to carry your cargo, how well to balance your load. Okay. God, this gets... Whoa! Neat! I should probably just carry it on my back. I'm, uh, I'm figuring that they're not gonna do too much to me right out the gate. Oh, I have stuff on my sides as well, on my hips. Let's just carry this in the back. Okay, did I put five ladders in? Oh, I probably shouldn't have done that, should I? Okay. Bridges boots. I also have some extra bridges boots. You know what? Screw it. Let's do it. Let's head out. I have my cargo. 
I'm loaded up like a pack mule. God. Hopefully this is easier than carrying my dead mom. Thank you. I'm a delivery man. I can't wait until I get my order to deliver pizza. <laughs> Sam. What? Triple check your loadout, I take it. No. <laughs> okay, so I have the rope, climbing anchor, I have my pee. I have this. Okay. Who's talking to me? Oh! Bye guys! I'ma head out! Me and my boots! Alright, come on little fetus! Alright, where- Where am I going? <laughs> I need to remove- How do I remove this marker? It's still kind of showing some of it. Okay, let's- let's just- okay, this is super confusing. Let's just place a waypoint. I can put down where I want to go and how I want to get there. I'm figuring I kind of want to go down along this way. So we'll go to like there, we'll go to here. This is literally what the game is, by the way. From what I've seen, this is all the game is. So, you're either going to be into it, or you're not. <laughs> uh, okay. That's good, right? I'm already lost. Okay, this is it, right? Pretty sure this is it. Yes. Okay, good. Alright, I'm heading out. <laughs> SpongeBob meme. I I'ma head out. Which sign? This sign? What does this sign say? By Nick Easton. I... What does it say? I can like it a bunch of times! Oh, 98, I almost broke a hundo. Okay, so I can put down my own sign? Oh! I want to put down... something fun. <laughs> Likers get liked! <laughs> There we go. Likers get liked, y'all. Put down by Jack Septicai. If you find that, you better give me a billion likes. All of the stuff that I'm putting down in this game, you better give me a million billion likes. I need them. Otherwise, how is the series gonna continue? If we don't have likes, we have nothing. Give me likes or give me death. Sam. Yes. Even the best porters have been known to lose their cargo. But you're better than the best. You've got what it takes to finish what they started. If you come across any abandoned shipments, consider taking them to their intended destination. It's easier than you might think. See, all our packages are tagged with Bridges IDs for easy tracking. And your Odradek is equipped with a scanner which might detect said IDs. Okay, Odradek. Which is a roundabout way of saying, but that thing on your shoulder can help you locate mislaid shipments. Okay. Thank you. You guys do an awful lot of talking. And here you go again. <laughs> Remember, Sam. Every parcel is a promise made to a person in need. And they're counting on you to deliver. Okay, got it. That's that's a lot of pressure. Okay, I can make it across this easy. Here we go. Fight the tide. Ah! A rising tide raises all ships. There you go. What a legend. I'm all tired. <laughs> Alright, uh... Pick up with your hand. And carry it on back. Look at the size of me! This is unrealistic. This is putting unrealistic expectations on people. How am I gonna... <laughs> this, is, this is basically like when you told your mother that you wanted to carry all the bags in from from the shop and all at once. She's like, no, just do it in different orders. I'm like, okay, whatever, mom. I'm the best. Oh god, now I'm all slow.
I need to check the water to see if it's if it's crossable. Oh, there's rising things here. Does that mean BTs? That sound is cool though. All right, I'm heading. Where am I heading? Where? Keep it up. Who are you talking to? Is this where I'm going? I think so, yeah. I, I need to confirm. Yes. How did he say that I can offload all of my things? Because I feel like I have too much on my back now at once. Cargo. There we go. Maybe I should start offloading some of these things to my sides. Uh, select you. Attach to suit. Yes! Attach to right shoulder. And then we'll take another ladder, attach to suit, attach to left shoulder. There we go. Perfecto. That did not work! I have to confirm it. There we go. All right. Jesus Christ, Sam. So I'm gonna keep picking shit up. I need to be careful. Oh, this is tricky. There's a lot of... Uh, 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 yeah, out of boy. There's a lot of tricky terrain here for our boy, Sam. He's gonna get through it with the help of us. What? Sam. Yes. A well-placed ladder can get you safely across most rivers, you know. Maybe try to what we issue you. Oh god, there's momentum to everything. I can't just stop. Oh god. Um... I don't think I'm- uh, should I pick up this one? Uh, I should probably just pick up everything, shouldn't I? Carry on back. Why not? I have the weight of the world on my back now. If only I had a donkey or something with me. What is this thing? Today's a good day. <sighs> this one's for you. Ah, I almost beat my record. I need to get over. I need to get over a hundred. What is? What does the terminal do? Good work, Sam. I see you brought in some lost cargo. Oh. Feel free to submit it here for processing. If you come across any more while out on a run and don't think you can carry it to its destination, you can always put it in storage. Oh! It'll be safe and secure until another porter comes along to finish the job. Even if it has to pass through a dozen more hands before it arrives, you can rest easy knowing you did your part. So we can actually offload it to somewhere and then other players can pick it up and bring it the rest of the distance. That's cool. Interesting in continuing the de delivery of lost cargo. So, it all depends on what I get for delivering cargo. Because if I put this in here and then somebody else gets a bunch of stuff for delivering it, but I get nothing. If lost cargo is taken to a facility other than its intended destination, the following options can be selected. Entrust delivery, submit the cargo to the f at the facility, and entrust its delivery to another player. Don't entrust, do not submit the cargo, keeping it on your person in order to deliver it yourself. That's a neat idea. I like that. Because the idea of the game is to bring people together and create strands. So I'm curious that in a year's time when this game is out, will there just be messages and cargo and ladders and bridges and all this stuff just lying around all over the game world? Because it's empty now. So I'm wondering if it's better to play the game now or in a year when everybody's populated the world. That's fascinating. Uh... Let's do like three. What'd I get? Did I get likes? Okay. Should I- Oh! Cargo has been entrusted to another player. <laughs> Just pass on your problems to somebody else. All right, miscellaneous. 
I still don't really know what I'm doing. <laughs> I didn't get rid of all my ladders, did I? No. After sending likes, you'll have to wait a while before you can give more likes to that same object or individual. Oh, okay. That makes sense. There's another thing right here, though. Can I just deliver the rest of the stuff to this? Hold on! I have to go grab all this. It's my destiny. It's my purpose as a porter. But this is the stuff that I'm talking about. You guys are gonna have to let me know if you wanna see all of this. For the first few episodes, it's fine, because we're figuring out the game loop and how it works. But you guys are gonna have to let me know if you wanna see this type of stuff, or if you want to just get more of the story. I can see this being a very divided game though. Some people will love the sort of exploring aspect and figuring things out and just kind of meditating out in the wild. Sam, if you come up against a sheer cliff or a steep slope, don't forget about the ladder we issue here. Be I sure to try it out. I'd be interested to see what use as a seasoned pro like you might find for it. I I get it. You want me to use your damn ladder? This dude's very proud of his ladders. I don't need a Crypto bite or whatever they're called. Good old Nikki's. I'm gonna activate your terminal again. Okay, make delivery, deliver lost cargo. Oh wait, I can select multiple. There. So only the stuff that I've picked up can I actually get rid of. I can't get rid of anything else. So I can't actually get rid of my ladders if I wanted to. That's good. Oh, I'm so speedy again! Look at me go, BB! I'm an animal! What do we got out here? Ooh, timefall. Sam, remember that prolonged exposure to timefall damages cargo containers. Don't stay out in the rain any longer than you have to. Oh, god damn it. I mean, again, that's kind of cool. What is this? What are you? You're like a crystal. See, this type of thing. This is super cozy. Just running out in the wild. I have a, I have a soft spot for being out in the rain with like a hood up or sitting under a tree. Or just rain in general. Maybe it's because I'm from Ireland and that's all we have. <laughs> What happened? Time follow accelerates passive time and anything it touches. Supposed to time follow renders cargo containers less impact resistant. Okay. Oh god. Oh god, BTs. Yeah, I feel you. Uh oh. Okay. So the closer to the closer to them I am, the more the thing blinks. Oh god. It's so tense. This game is gorgeous. Okay, last time I didn't do very well with this. What is this? Emergency gas fuel. Oh my god! Oh Jesus, oh Jesus, oh Jesus, okay. Okay, I'm gonna hold my breath and go this way. Oh man, when the time fall lands, plants grow and die together. Disconnected from chiral network, oh no. That sounds awful. Okay, okay. Okay, okay. I'm going this way. I'm gonna just head up the mountain then. Because this seems like a bad time back there. Oh, man. Okay, maybe there's a way around them. Oh, it's so tense! That's- that's really neat. I like that. Okay, sometimes my cargo blocks where the hell my Odra deck 
is- I can't remember what he's called. I'm just going to call you Flappy. <laughs> you cool with that, Flappy? Okay, awesome. You don't get a choice. I want to know what all these crystals are. Do I need a thing to be able to get them later on? Okay, I'm running because I'm nowhere near them anymore. Oh. Ooh. The Death Stranding's to blame for all of this. The gazers, the fall of America, everything. <laughs> it warped the world beyond recognition. Humanity had to scramble like rats fleeing a sinking ship. Oh, that's but so there's cool looking. Nowhere else to go. There's no future living like this. If we're to survive, we need to find another way. A way to overcome the BTs. The Death Stranding, the whole damn mess. Okay. Look at that! This- I love this type of visual imagery. This sort of like, really clean technology look that they have. The, the way the suits look in this game, the way containers look, the way everything looks visually is really striking. And not only that, but they chose- like Icelandic territory is really cool to look at. It almost looks like you're on Venus or Mars or somewhere. I mean, it's very- uh, those planets look a lot like Earth in some of the, like, drone footage that you see. But this type of stuff in the distance, like, this type of structure just looks cool. It's so futuristic, but it's so... realistic at the same point? I- I- I, I don't know what I'm trying to say, but I have a very strong emotional connection to this type of visual imagery. It's like, um, oh my god, this is a stupid idea. Oh, my things actually have rust on them now, that's cool. Okay, okay, we're gonna have to shift a Rooney some of this. Because this is not gonna work. Can I carry... Can I carry you on my... Oh god, I can carry it in my hand. Can carry the other one in your hand? Is that good or bad? <laughs> I don't know. Oh wait, yeah, I have to confirm it. That's sort of annoying. Okay, I can't do that. <laughs> I'm mega slow. Okay, we're gonna have to figure this out. This is part of the... the stuff as well. Uh, let's... Oh, I can just Okay, move to back and move to back. All right. Oh, and if you're near stuff, it shows up in the cargo menu anyway. That's cool. I don't actually have to have it on me as long as I'm near it. Uh Okay, I can't attach to suit. So I'm going to have to start attaching this stuff to my suit. All right, attach. At no, dang it. Yeah, we're gonna do this. Okay. Okay, we're at 105 kilos. You're carrying 105 kilos on you? Okay, we might have to dump one of the gases. Ooh, I can use a ladder though. Right? Let's do that. Uh, ladder time. It's ladder time. Come on, grab your friends. Okay, what's... Place. Epic! I might have to place another one. Oh god. Can I- let's scan this to see how hard it is to get up this. It's nigh on impossible, lads! I'm gonna have to place another ladder. Can I- Oh, we can place one here. There we go. 
everyone's gonna like that. Everyone's gonna come along and be like, man, that Jacksepticeye fella has something going on. That lad's a smart lad. Okay. There we go. I have to get up there! Oh. I'll probably go this way. Just keep hunkering down, lads, and you'll make it. There just won't be much sprinting going on. You are going to be monstrous after this, Sam. Um, you're going to be an absolute fucking unit. Okay, easy does it, easy does it, not in the water for long. Yes. I know you can also get mechanical legs after this. Or like an exoskeleton that you can put on that helps you just move faster. Oh, God. Okay, we're probably just going to have to hunker this down until we get here. This is a lot of cargo! But I was going to say that the imagery reminds me of the... I talked about this when I played Abzu. How you doing, Sam? You're talking to yourself, man. I'm doing good, Sam. How about you? The Simon Stolenhog paintings are stuff that reminds me of this. I have a couple of them in my house. That this sort of, like, natural stuff meets futuristic-y... Structures? It's really cool. So visually, this game is a 10 out of 10 so far. Sound design, 10 out of 10 as well. Hi! It's me! Turtle Man! I can't wait until I find Conan O'Brien or Jeff Keighley in the game. Make delivery! Deliver requested cargo. We'll do that one first. All cargo is required to be delivered. The order can be completed. Okay. Confirm. Oh, I did it. Okay. Again, the menu is very confusing. Delivering cargo. Thank you. Thank you. We've all been feeling the loss of Central Knot City. No one seemed to know what it meant for the organization. Or the UCA. Or us. And the oxytocin will take the edge off and that'll be a big help. <laughs> Won't be long before we're back on track. We may have a look. The heroin will really take the edge off. It'll help me sleep at night. This is great. When I can't remember what Thank my own you, face yeah. looks like. Yeah, everything looks to be in good order. And soon our way station will be too, I hope. It's pronounced PlayStation? Idiot. <laughs> cool! How many likes it again? This is awesome! I got a good rank. What's increasing on this? I have a massive spike on into miscellaneous. I don't know if that's good or not. You're with the second team, right? Where are the others? Dead. Dead. Caught in the void out. No way. That one blast got them all? And what, they just sent you out on your own? I mean, if it was just... Oh god, sorry. I clicked X by accident. Just delivery, that'd be one thing. Porters come through time to time, but... team was meant to bring the Cupid. They were gonna connect us up. Three years we've been waiting for help. Three years. And they sent us one guy who was... Shit, shit, shit. Tell Language. you brought more than the Oxy, at least. I've got the Cupid. You... Really? So it's true. They finally got it working. Well, then you just might be the answer to my prayers. So, what are you waiting for? But you, you put us on the goddamn grid. Okay, calm down there, Bookaroo. Is this the Cupid? There's a lot of terminology coming at you like Cleopatra. Ooh, that was a chunky sound. Oh, that was a meaty bad boy. That was awesome. Ooh, sound design. Fucking top notch, bro. Bruh. We're on the grid! America's coming back online! PlayStation West! <laughs> the following structure can now be constructed using the PCC. I don't even know what a PCC is. I hardly know her. New options have been added to the delivery terminals. Fabricate equipment, make delivery. Yeah, fabricating equipment is something that I'm really into. I want to make a bike. I want to make uh, special legs. And I want to make that little thing that you can put the cargo on that you bring around behind you. And that it floats on the ground. Nice. This area is now connected to the chiral network, enabling you to see and access other player structures. 
Ah, cool. Connection to Capital Not City confirmed. It's really happening. <laughs> Just like Amelie promised. We can finally do what we came here to do. Hey, um, you're headed west, right? Uh -huh. There's gonna be a lot of people happy to see you. I guess you'll keep on until you hit the coast, huh? Which means you'll get to see Amelie in person. Oh, that's something. That is really something. I... Me, I've never met her. Only seen her hollow messages back when I was with the first expedition. Well, anyway, you best be careful on the road. There's some bad people out there. More than good, some say. <laughs> but I don't need to tell you that. Huh. Thank you, Sam. By bringing that way station into the Cairo network, you've put it in direct contact with those of us back here in Capital Not City. Right. What's next? West of the way station are a couple of structures our previous expedition put in place. And beyond them is your next destination. Port Not City. It's on the shore Port of the that formed after the first void out. Your objective is to link up Port and Capital Not. But to do that, you'll need to utilize our facilities as additional waypoints. They'll be essential for establishing a stable connection. Given the distance we need to cover, we're looking at using a distribution center and a power station. As to which you should head for first. Start with the distro center. We've got some cargo that needs delivering anyway. Check the nearby delivery terminal to pick it up. Okay. I mean, again, don't get me wrong. I know that this is what the game is. But it feels a bit weird that I'm doing this as one person out on my own like a pack mule. Instead of bringing a car or more people. Your hard work's paying off, Sam. Hank. Thanks to the increase in network capacity, HQ is now in a position to provide you with additional materials and support. Should prove useful. Uh, okay. I don't need to do that yet. I need to deliver lost cargo. I need to get these fucking gas tanks off my back. This was also not that far from where I was. Maybe they're just trying to condense the world to make it seem like it's bigger. Look at all that miscellaneous. People think of you as a porter who can be relied upon for basic orders, but with time and effort, you may one day be recognized as a true legend. I'm gonna be a legend! You guys better watch out. The legend is coming. The legend with the legs. You can't spell legend without leg. You have reached miscellaneous grade 10. You will now receive more likes. Oh, hell yeah. Dude, my Twitter and Instagram are gonna pop off. Uh, fabricate equipment. What can I fabricate? Ladders. Sam, you can use that PCC to build a post box. Thank you. PCCs can be used to build structures, but be aware that doing so will use up some of the chiral bandwidth available to you. Structures can be shared with other players once built. Prepare structure, build structure. Okay. Uh, postbox level one. Postboxes can be used to return lost cargo or entrust cargo. Okay. Should I build one? Yes. How do I... How do I commit to this? There we go. Fabricate this equipment. Yes. Did I put it on my back? Oh, it's tiny. Uh, no, I will confirm. Okay, cool. Orders for Sam. Rare metal delivery to the way station. Okay, so I should I should probably just do these then, right? Uh, accept orders. Yes. Okay, I'm starting to understand the menu system a little more. In the post box, you'll need to use a PCC. It goes without saying, but if you're not already carrying a PCC, you'll want to fabricate. I have one. They say my first brodeo. Okay, orders accepted. To build a post box, you'll need. To I. It goes. I have one. Are you gonna make me build another one?
Oh god. Oh god. Oh god. Um. <laughs> hang on, tool rack. Okay, let's hang this one on a tool rack as well. Can I? <laughs> god. I didn't realize I had so much stuff. Ah, oh, Samwise, what are we gonna do? We're gonna fall over so many times. Sam. Yeah. Assuming you've got your PCC in order. Mm hmm Head to the site I designated and build that post box, would you? You should have no trouble finding it if you check your map and compass from time to time. Uh so it's this one down here, yep. Alright. Cool! Wee -hee -hee. I think I built too many PCCs for this. But you know what? I was gonna say you can never have too much of a good thing, but you can. Everything in moderation. Uh, I'm the best little delivery boy. You guys are lucky to have me. What would you do if I wasn't here? You'd all starve and die. But no, Norman Reedus will free us with his fetus. Okay, this is... This is a bad idea. Okay, I should have gone down here. Can I, uh... Can I just fall? Am I gonna break everything? <sighs> Don't break the cargo! Oh, You know how basketball players say ball is life? For Sam, cargo is life. Okay, go, 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 go. Ah, oh, frickin' time fall again, really? Time fall sucks. I'm just like, I'm just like Samwise from Lord of the Rings. He was a pack mule for Frodo. I'm gonna bring the one ring to Mordor. They headed east though, not west. God, the open world in this is really fucking big. I'm here. Sam. Yes. Uh. So you've arrived at the designated site. Yep. Good. Boop. Whoa! So PCC stood for pretty cool. Chiral Network! Hell yeah! This is awesome! I'm doing so good. Can I like my own thing and feel good about myself? That's a fun compost box. If you access it and select share locker, you can share cargo and equipment with your fellow porters. Deposit a ladder and a climbing anchor, and I'm sure someone will eventually come along and use it. No! If you've got enough supplies, why not leave some behind? Because I'm a greedy bitch! Right by you. There's no one else playing the game right now, anyway. God, this, this scenery is so nice! This is everything I wanted in, like... In a game! I like this stuff. Okay, so we need to head to the distribution center, so I'm gonna put a marker down on that one. Um... Alright, Samwise! Are you ready for a journey? We're going a long distance though. I think it tells you how long it's going to take, actually. 1366 meters. I don't know how long that will take. Plot route. Okay, can I remove the marker on this one? I wish I would just remove it when I got to it. Ah, anyway. On the road again! I can't wait to get on the road again! Sam is an absolute powerhouse. I like him a lot. Okay, I'm a, I'm gonna do a, a cheeky one here. Can I, can I pee? <gasps> He's gonna pee! I'm doing it, I'm peeing! Ho oh, ho, video games have come so far. Look everybody, I'm pissing. Oh, yeah. It's all that monster energy you've been drinking. No, where are you going? Good lord. You just start walking forward. I made a mushroom. My pee makes mushrooms. 
That's epic. All right, go, Sam. <laughs> now that you've no pee in you, you're much lighter. You should be able to fly along this. Uh, I wonder, should I cross and go down on that side? Probably. Can I, can I see on my map which is better? Yeah, that's better. Or, is it? Yeah, I'm gonna have to cross somewhere here anyway. Okay. Man, I kinda like this. I thought I would hate this. Like, trying to figure out how to get across stuff and planning my routes and... Train to canteen to restore stamina. Do I need to? Yeah, but then you're gonna have to pee again. Uh, but I thought I would hate all of this planning and management and trying to get from A to B and figure things out, but honestly, it's kind of nice. It's not gonna be for everybody. A lot of people are gonna hate this. But I like just being in the world and running along and doing my thing. That is not good. That's stupid, Sam. What did you do? BB, tell him. Yell at him. Okay, what does the floaty stuff mean? I thought that that would mean there was BTs nearby. But it seems to be around these crystals. Are they BTs? Okay, there's a, there's a post box thingy down here. I can at least get rid of one thing. Hugo Delaray. Is that a real person or not? I don't know yet. I don't know what's real people, and what's stuff just generated by the game, because it's going to have to have some stuff generated by the game to show you how it works. Hup, hup, hup. Come on, we gotta beat a hundred. Yeah, hundred and ten. Hell yeah. Okay, we're going all the way down there. Oh my god, there's so many things. Can I scan from here? No. Good God. All right. I'm a head out. I thought that was a post box, but it wasn't. Oof. This is some tricky terrain coming up here, Sam boy. Do 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 do. I wonder if some of the missions have you just like walking in one direction for like an hour. <laughs> I mean, we've been recording for a long time on this one. Oh god, what's happening? What are you doing to me? Why why is happening? What is this thing? What happened? Heads up, Sam. Your cargo's been pinged. Who that? Now, before someone has eyes on you. Oh god. To your destination ASAP if you don't want to get caught. Oh! God, Sam! There's people trying to kill us! Oh Jesus. I'm a nice lad though! I'm only trying to deliver stuff. That's creepy. Shouldn't have stood next to it. I was like, go, oh, what's this? Oh god, is it gonna get pinged again here? Don't do it. Don't do it. Ah, oh, shite. You stinky. Okay, okay, we're heading up this way, Sam. I don't care how we get there now. I just don't want to get attacked and lose all my cargo. I've worked very hard. Get your own stuff, you stinky smooth brains! Oh god, I'll fall over. Ah, <laughs> oh, Christ! Ooh, maybe hide in tall grass? Ah, but that would still leave me kind of too close to them. Oh, shite. Oh, shite. 
Oh god, oh god. Oh, this is the riskiest move of the day. Oh god. Oh god. Gah! Careful, Sam. Careful. Careful. There's a lot of knobbly hobblies. Oh god. I dead right. Exact same mood. Okay, just take it slowly. Because the character kind of moves on his own a little bit because he has so much weight on his back that he's been pulled in different directions, so I have to kind of counteract that every now and then. Oh god, there's pingy things everywhere! There's one down here too. Okay, 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 okay. Easy does it. It's like trying to guide a pony and a whale at the same time. Fuck. Am I going in the right direction? Okay, we're still going over this way. Go, go, go. What happened? Oh, BTs. Any water or other... Any time fall or other water that comes into contact with the canteen is absorbed and filtered, making it safe for you to drink. Oh, so the time fall actually helps as well. Wait, I'm at 7.59 in my canteen though, it's not going up. So does that mean I should just jump into the water every now and then? That's neat. I'm just gonna say it, I think this game is awesome. I'm having a great time. Mainly because I just have a a giant erection for this type of scenery. And like, ah, oh, the the fog that kind of hangs over everything, giving it that look. It's very realistic. Come on, George Baton! This one's for you, this one's for you George! Ah, oh, yeah. That's good. Okay. Let's deliver some lost cargo at least. Nice. We can get that off our backs. I'm a very trustworthy guy. If you guys need fuel or drugs, I'm the lad to give it to you. Just come contact Jack and Sam. Which is perfect, because the septic guy is named Sam. It all worked out. Okay, easy does not So these things need to go to Capital Not City anyway. I'm kinda heading that way? Should I put stuff in a shared locker then and then... Pick it up when I get closer? I'm not really sure how that works yet. Whoa, 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 Oh god. BT time? Or are we away from the BTs? Rhonda McDonald! Eh! Slow down there, Sam. What does it say? Ghost? I'm gonna give it some likes anyway, Rhonda! Oh, Rhonda, I got you almost up to 2 hundo. Shit. Okay, we don't have to go through this song and dance every time. I get it. Oh god. You're doing this on purpose, game. Putting me straight through BT territory. God, all the cars are destroyed and everything. That's crazy. No, can you... Can you move some of this cargo around there, Sam? Can you be a little smart about it? Which one is which? This one, yeah. Take that off and attach it to the suit. There you go. Oh wait, I have to hold confirm. 
You don't need to hover over confirm, you just need to hold X. Much better! Oh god. Oh Jesus. Okay, I'm gonna drink some of my canteen to get some of my stamina back. Damn, this shit gets scary. Because you really start feeling like, okay, my cargo is very precious. I really need to take care of it. Okay, okay, we're very close to one. Okay, got it. Jesus. I feel like I have to hold my actual breath. Okay, okay, easy does it. Slow and steady. Slow and steady. Okay. 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 Okay, keep them behind you. Or not. Okay, this green one I'm gonna pick up, but not the other one. The other one's way too big. We're getting quite heavy now as well. The other one I don't even think I would be able to pick up. Oh my god. Shit, shit, oh god, super close. I'm actually holding my breath! <laughs> okay, okay. It's back over there somewhere. Okay, we should be out of it very soon. Oh, I can see through that rock. That's a bug. <laughs> okay, okay, okay. That was intense! Whew. Thank Christo! Oh! Is it just broken? Something wrong, Sam? I don't know. Kid doesn't look so hot. Uh, nothing to worry about. Its functions are temporarily suspended, but they can be restored. I can perform the necessary maintenance at a distribution center. Hurry, though. God, you guys just want me to go everywhere. Be your bitch. BB is suffering from auto texmia or something? Auto texima? I don't blame him. That shit was rough. Oh god! Oh god! What happened? How did you fall over just standing still? I think we're heading this way. Yeah. Okay, we're almost there, BB. Hold on, little fella. Hold on, my sweet little Norman fetus. Okay, I think it's big ladder time. I don't know if it'll reach all the way across that, though. That doesn't help at all. Yeah, do! <laughs> I'm a genius! Oh, head to the big boat building. Yes? When the strain on your BB exceeds sustainable levels, it triggers the production of harmful compounds, and the body, in essence, begins to attack itself. It's called autotoxemia. Autotoxemia? If your BB's not performing to spec, Drop by your private room and see if the incubator helps. Okay, got it. He just needs a little help every now and then. 
I can't blame them. We all need a little help now and then. Oh, I can only carry that in hand. Okay, let's see if I can move this stuff. Attach to suit. There we go. Just where everything's balanced and nice. Ah, oh, God. Okay. That didn't really help me getting over here. Okay, you can do it. You can do it. Just don't go in the red. Oh, God. Ah, oh, God. The current's taking me. <sighs> We're fine, everybody. We're just a little way down at the moment. But all we need to do is get to there, and then we're good. But how do we get across? There's no fjords! Okay. Ooh, that's a lot of deep water. Wait, let's check the map and see if there was a better place to cross. Yeah, probably right there. Okay, I'm gonna have to keep going further down. Cause I won't be able to cross here, boys. I'll be fecked. Okay, I constantly need to hold L2 and R2 now because I'm way too over encumbered. Ooh, there's the wind farm! That's awesome! Look at it in the distance! This is one of the cooler open worlds I've seen. Not for like the contents in it, but for the the visual aspect of it. I know, I keep talking about it, but I can't help it. It's awesome. It's awesome. Everything's so mountainous. You alright there, Sam? You holding in? I hope so. I know it's a lot. But we'll get there in the end, and you'll be happy for it. I am slowly running out of stamina each time I walk, though, by holding on to everything. So I'm just hoping to get up here and cross over with a ladder, and then we'll be okay. It's all cardio, baby. Feel it in your thighs. Feel that burn. It's good. Oh, get through it, Sam. Push through. Only 500 more reps. If not more. <laughs> I feel his pain, though. No music has played for a while. That's kind of neat. I haven't uploaded the first episode yet, so I don't know if it got claimed or not. I wonder if a lot of YouTubers will have problems with it. There's no option to turn down music or anything either. Or, like, turn copyrighted music off like some games. Okay. Can my lad A? It's the only one I have left. So we're gonna have to make it count. Yes. That's a long boy. Anybody who uses this in the game, you better appreciate it. 100 million likes. It'll also be interesting to see uh, players like figure out the fastest routes for things to help each other out. Calm down, BB. No, 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 don't go in. Oh, none of it's yellow. Oh, we're fine. Nice. Okay. Crouch for a second. Can we drink our canteen? We filled up our canteen because we went through water. Need some of that stamina back. Why does it not all go up? I'm still missing a chunk. I guess we'll never know. Look at that giant vape pipe. This type of running around so far hasn't gotten that bad, but I do wonder if there's just like 15 hours of this. Be very curious. Also, I guess those guys don't mess with the BTs because they don't have dooms, so they can't sense them, and they'll just run into them by accident all the time. They also don't have BBs, little bridge baby boys. 
My sweet little bouncy baby bridge baby boy. Ooh, I saw lightning. Upside down rainbow. That's a cool signifier that BTs are in the area. But also, why? I'm here. Scan me. Sam Porter Bridges. Beginning scan. Scanning bridges ID. Beginning Sam. ID. Clear. Weapons detected. Uh, I'm here. I'm here. Oh, let me in. Let me in. This is like when you reach a bonfire in Dark Souls. You're like, oh, finally, I can get rid of all this cargo. <sighs> uh. Oh, I don't have any. Sweet. I'm sorry that they're a little rushed it. It's not my fault that the time fall falls everywhere. Waystation talks so mail about you. Sam Bridges, with the second expedition, right? Hell yeah. The guy expanding the chiral network on his boss. What he's not out making deliveries. I do this Until because I care. Let's see it. Talk about above and beyond. <laughs> Thanks. No problem. Must have had to pass through BT territory to get here too, didn't you? <laughs> Hey, weren't joking when they said you were a legend. <laughs> Thank you! I'm a legend! You heard it here first! Jack Sept guy is a legend! Give me all those likes! It's awesome! I need the likes for my self-esteem and ego to make myself feel good. Oh yes, look at them all go in. Thank you! Okay, it's time. Do you mind connecting us to the network? No problem. I want to hear this chunky fat boy sound again. Listen to it. Wait for it. Oh, that's some Transformers shit. I love that. Nice. I don't know what it's doing, but I'll upvote anyway. I've half of America covered already. Sam, as always, thanks for bringing more folks into the UCA. No problem. Thank you for calling and just saying that. It really bolsters my confidence in myself. New interview data acquired. Mules and drone syndrome. Bridge babies. Time for. <laughs> Imagine trying to explain death stranding to people. You're just like, okay, mules and drone syndrome. All right. Bridge babies. Time for. Sam. Dooms. Beach things BTs. Upside down rainbow, tiny baby. You get it. <laughs> uh, a new option has been added to delivery terminals. Recycle. Ooh. Hell yeah, I did that. That was me. Here he's now connected to the chiral network. So the chiral network is how you connect to other players Looks playing like the game. Thank you, Henry Cavill. West, and keep on doing what you do. Ah! Good. The <laughs> He's back! On the network. Ah! Yeah. There's two of them! Take your BB to a private room and connect it to the incubator. Okay. Good work. Am I not able to deliver any of this other stuff? Oh, now I can. I just needed to c deliver that one first. I can't bring it to Edge Not City, but I don't really want to. We're still quite a distance away from there, and I'm gonna pick up a bunch more shit along the way, so. I just need those likes right now. Give them to me. Give me that. Give me that. Ooh! I have a big spike in delivery volume. My little dude's getting legs. Recycle cargo to produce new materials. Ooh. Resin? Metals, metals, resins. Let's do that. Can, can I not? Oh. I don't know what's going on. 
Oh, cargo to recycle. Oh, okay, I did it. There we go. Oh, so much lighter! Can you believe that stuff was just lying around? I just found that. And now I can break a brand new dog! Yeah, she's dead. Sorry, bro. Oh, the chiral crystals. New materials are now available at distribution centers. Whoop whoop! Okay, fabricate equipment. Unable to fabricate a chiral printer interface could not be detected. I- Fine, I'll go rest in the private room first. My baby's upset, I need to feed him. I'm gonna go breastfeed my baby as Norman Reedus. I know your name is Sam, but you will always be Norman to me. If only I could get a crossbow in this game. Dead man, you there? Little help. Okay, Sam. Remove the pod and connect it to that incubator. There you go, little BB. Who's, who's my good, bouncy little baby bridge baby boy? Good. Uh, a temporary excess of stress. Easily addressed if we return it to its mother's womb. Mother? Uh, located in the capital not city ICU. Brain dead, of course. Ah, uh, you mean still mother. Correct. A still mother's womb facilitates a connection between the world of the dead and the BB. And you, in turn, Connect yourself to a BB, granting you the ability to sense BTs. Okay. These pods were designed to simulate the conditions inside a still mother's womb. BBs need to believe they're in one at all times to function properly. However, we can only maintain this deception for so long, which is why we must periodically update the environmental data by synchronizing it with a still mother via the chiral network. Gotcha. There. The update is in progress. <laughs> right now, the pod is synchronizing with the still mother in Capital Not City. I'm updating the firmware on my baby. Based on the latest data. Returning your BB to the womb in this manner will temporarily reduce its stress levels. That being where it technically belongs, of course. So cute. Hi. <laughs> Looks happy. I'll try adjusting the oxytocin dosage. Autotoxemia should set in much slower from now on. <sighs> you giving him oxytocin? You should remember that BBs are just equipment. Try not to get attached. <laughs> Each one has been physically removed from its steel mother's womb. A process that renders them unpredictable and prone to failure. No BB on record has remained in service for over a year. Mm. Uh, it may need to be retired before this expedition is over. Mm. And then? saying there's no way to keep my BB alive? <sighs> you must understand. There is still a great deal we don't know about BBs. As we expand the chiral network and recover more past data, perhaps we'll find our answers. Uh, oh, right. You asked me to look into why the BTs might be reacting to your blood. I spoke with Hartman. We should have your results soon. Anyway, get some rest. You and your BB are both exhausted. <sighs> Good night, Sam. Just like that, he's gone like magic. Little disappearing Guillermo del Toro. Oh, that's cute. Also kind of messed up that I'm going to have to destroy that baby before the end of it. Oh, that does not look very comfortable. Well then, it does really feel though like, oh, I'm finally here, I can get some rest.
thought you were on the beach. Sam? Can you see me? How are things over there? Still not under guard. Still not chained up. Still can't leave. But if you can keep making connections, if you can get to me, we can go back east, back home. Thank you. I mean that. It's bad. There are fewer and fewer people in the cities these days. No one's having children anymore. But humans aren't made for living alone. They're supposed to come together, to help one another. And if we as a people can't do that, if we can't reconnect, then, well, it's like Bridget said, extinction. Come on. Rebuilding America isn't gonna get rid of the BTs. As long as they're still around, there's no escaping it. But at least we'll have hope. Oh boy, hope. I'll be waiting, Sam. Waiting for you. Come and find me. Man, why does everybody do that to me? For a game all about bringing people together, it sure does paint a nice picture of no one ever actually being here. <laughs> it's like we need to rebuild and bring everybody together. But everyone talks to me through holograms. Well, Sam, this is Hartman. Since you're awake, it might behoove you to freshen up. To that end, why not take a shower? It's good for the body and so, and also my research as it happens. <laughs> Norman Reedus just winked at me. At me, not you. He winked at me, specifically. I'm the best boy for Norman. Yeah, get that Reedus butt! Show us what you're made of, Norman! Sam, this is hard work. Dead man will make your request. I'll be taking a sample of your shower water in order to study the effects your bodily fluids might have on a BT. <laughs> you study other people with dooms? Everyone in Bridges, myself and Mama. Results thus far are inconclusive. But you possess other singular qualities, being a repatriate as well. I must confess to a measure of optimism. Processing fluids, waste products, chirality, dispensing. Ew. There, take the sample with you. Should the opportunity arise, try using it on a BT. I'm curious to see how they react. Uh. Who knows? It may even prove beneficial to you. There was an old research paper detailing the effects of bodily fluids from individuals like us on BTs. It is only by recovering these materials that we can unearth the knowledge of the past. Not just the death stranding, but also the mystery of your body's unique properties and even our doom's affliction. There may well be hope for humanity. Sam, I have no interest in rebuilding America. I want to recover the past. Okay. Five, oh, four, it's almost three, time. Two, one. After you make your connections and nothing happens, then what? Dude, I think he hung up on you. I said, then what? Cool. Everyone's so nice to me. What if... <clears throat> okay. Sam, We're going to talk again first. Sorry to bother you while you're taking a break, but I figured you'd want to hear this. Hell, maybe it'll help you rest easier. We received a number of messages addressed to you, and I've not taken a look myself, but I gather they're mostly from your clients. You should see if they contain any useful information. Mail can be accessed via your cufflinks, as well as the terminal in your private room. There's something else I'd like to share with you. 
It's my poetry. Chicago Network, we now have the power to reclaim our past. Data once thought lost forever from every corner of America can be pieced back together from fragmented records. Our archives are still a work in progress, of course. But as we expand the network and integrate more way stations and cities, we'll be able to recover more and more information, such as the previous expeditions, logs, and reports. Everything they sent back was lost when Central Knot City was destroyed. Now, we've managed to restore some already, in fact. You can access them from a private room terminal or your cufflinks by selecting archives. Might make for interesting reading. Gotcha. <laughs> hey, Norman. Uh, do I not have to take the thingy with me, or did you just take it anyway? I was going to say, a theory of mine now is that... What if the BBs, that thing of Mass Mickelson looking at the BBs, what if that person lying on the ground, Lisa... Yeah, I, I know. What if Lisa is the still mother who's stuck there and all her purpose is, is to have babies? What if they have a character who's just stuck there reproducing these bri bridge babies over and over and over again? That would be kind of messed up. And that's why we keep seeing Matt Mickelson, or his character. I can't remember what his character's name is. Cliff? Uh, okay, let's go to the mail. Benjamin Hancock. Sorry, Sam, bad news. Thanks for delivering those rare metals, Sam. Everyone at the dis- I thought it said disco center. <laughs> really appreciate you coming through for us. I'm afraid I got some bad news for you, though. That bike you saw outside, its battery's dead. You'll have to give it some juice if you want to use it. I didn't even see it. Only you need it to do it once, though. Auto charger should kick in after. Sorry we got your hopes up. And, uh, I've got some more bad news for you, too. Sad emoji face. You see, different facilities have to work together, sharing materials so everyone gets what they need. And to make sure that everything that's produced gets the proper use, that's why you guys are so important. Without porters, the whole system falls apart. Whole world, even. Anyway, there's this guy, George Baton. Over at the way station, he used to be a reliable reporter, blah 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 blah. Even when he does agree to make a run, he's liable to lose half his load on route, so yeah. Okay, so pick up his load. There he is, more than Oxy. Sam, the man's our savior. Things are looking up here at the way station, everything feels better somehow. Okay, I'm not gonna read all of this. Uh, that's what you need you, Sam, you're not scared of anything, right? So go show us how it's done. Okay, so it's just a little miscellaneous information. Okay, what are my orders? I have no orders. Awesome! Day off! Interviews. Okay. Again, I don't want to read these just yet because they probably have important information about the game and everything, but I don't want to bog down too much of the episode just about reading because a lot of the game is just cutscenes and sitting around and waiting for things to happen. So I, w I want to keep the... I want to keep it moving and going forward. Later on, we might read a bunch of them just to get more information on what the world is all about. Oh, ho, BB! What's up, my bouncy baby little bridge baby boy? Mm-hmm. The plot thickened like a fine soup. I still think that Mass Mickelson's character is like the dad of all the BBs. Hello! Sam, there's something I forgot to tell you. It's about managing your BB stress levels and reducing the risk of autotoxemic attacks. There are a few things you can do if your BB starts showing signs of distress. Such as? Such as take a moment to look after it. Cradle the pot, gently rock it, that sort of thing. Hmm. Out of curiosity, how's it doing at the moment? Uh, before I answer that... Something wrong? When I hook up my BB, I see things. What kind of things? Like a face, someone I don't know, calling to me. There's this room, too. With other people talking, but I can't make out the words. Mm, lead through effect. Didn't I warn you about this? You're mistaking the BB's memories for your own. Hmm. They're false flashbacks, nothing more. Let me explain. A BB is harvested from its steel mother at around 28 weeks <coughs> and placed in a pot. 
To be clear, this is before it's even born. The procedure halts its development. But even at 28 weeks, its sensory systems have matured enough to process external stimuli. It is more than capable of encoding this information into memories, which can bleed into yours via your connection. So who's the man I saw? Someone from the medical team, maybe? Or a BB technician? Does it matter? The BB has been in circulation for a while now. It's been handled by a lot of people. How should I know which one made an impression? Because mm. you're the expert. No one's an expert, Sam. BBs were developed decades ago in secret. They're your quintessential black boxes. We may use them, but we don't truly understand them. Believe me, I've been trying to learn more, but almost all of the old records are gone. If I find anything out, I'll tell you, all right? Dead man's honor. <laughs> cool, thanks, dead man. Okay. Ah. Hi! <laughs> so cute! I'm a dad now. Uh, it said 28 weeks. How long is a, a normal pregnancy? How many weeks is a pregnancy term? Here's what I found. 40 weeks? So, God, 28 weeks is very early on. That's messed up. Unfortunately, our printer is offline. I know, I know. After all the trouble you went through to bring us those materials, so I have to go to the wind farm and come back. We ordered a part a while back, but it never arrived. The printer needs it to communicate with the chiral network. Mules must have snatched it, caught that porter on route or something. If I'm right, they'll have taken it to their drop site, which is smack dab in the middle of their territory. Don't suppose you'd be up for stealing us our property back? Can't think of anyone more qualified than you. Mm, I'll think about it. Sounds dangerous. I live for danger. Cover Carl printer interface. Oh, it's not that far. Yeah, I'll do that. No problem, bud. Uh, and collection Carl crystals. Sure. What else am I going to do? Save the world? Mama's added a watchtower schematic to your PCC. If you don't have it on you, consider fabricating one. You never know when you'll need to recon an area. Man, so can other people then see my... See my watchtowers and stuff? You can just plant watchtowers all over the game. Man, I have so many PCCs now. Maybe I shouldn't have loaded all of them. Let's go, BB! Suggest it provides secure storage for any crystals you gather. Hell yeah. Now I know what to do with them. Stick it up your butt. Uh, 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 Hartman. Allow me to describe your quarry. Chiral crystals appear gold to the naked eye and have frequently found in formations resembling human handprints. Surrounding rocks and debris tend to float a few feet above the ground. Ah, right. And they are most commonly found in areas with high precipitation. Got all that? Hmm? Rain, floating rocks, golden handprints. That's your trifecta. Look for these three things and you'll find the crystals. If you've been especially observant, then perhaps you already know where to look. That was kind of condescending. Condescending. He was like, you got all that? Hmm? So he's like, I'll, I'll take it from here. And then he explained it like a toddler. <laughs> ah. Back in the world again. Ah, oh, there's the bike that they were talking about. Smell that air. Smells good, huh? Weapons restrictions lifted. Whoa. That's three, oh, uh, 3,000 likes. Because <laughs> of the bike. <laughs> Let's go. He's like, <laughs> stinky. I want to leave one. What can I leave? Something that doesn't work. Something that's funny to go along with this. He left a, a not happy face. I want to leave uh, something. Dang. I want to leave. Uh, do not use. <laughs> oh, 
god, we don't want to get on it. Free to use. Wait. And I said do not use. Damn it! Malanka! I'm gonna give you likes anyway. What? Sam, Cairo crystals are pretty small and can be difficult to spot with the naked eye. I'd advise you to use your ultra deck to point you in the right direction. There's one right here. If you want to survey a wider area, though, you might consider building a watchtower and relying on its sensors. Gotcha. Collect at least one CG of chiral crystals. Do I not have to go that far then to do the rest? All right, I'm gonna make a watchtower here just because they keep telling me to, and I want to. So let's no. This one. Switch structure. Whoa. Yeah! Build that shiz! Dope. So big. Go, little PCC. Go. No, it's not ready. I'm looking at it. Now printing. Construction. Wow. Look at all those chickens! There's so much to see. So much to do. What is this? Sandalweed. What? Can I make new boots? Okay, what is this telling me to do? BT area west of capital, not city. Collect slash retrieve. Okay. What did I have to do with this one? Just collect chiral crystals? That's that one. Alright. I did that though. Do I actually have to go into the area to do it or can I just come back already and complete it? Just a bit further now. Cause technically I'm in... BT area already. Because it's raining. None of that's red. I can technically go across that. Alright, pick up this one and we'll head back and see what's what. Come on, Sam, run! You're faster than that! Slow boy. Slow stinky boy. Uh, yeah, fuck this indeed, Sam. Let's get out of here. This place sucks. Maybe they'll accept this and I can just go on to the next mission. They better accept my love. Oh, I really want that bike. So all I need to do is get a battery for it. Sam. What? Process is pretty simple though. Access the delivery terminal to drop off any Cairo crystals you're carrying. It's a little different, but do the exact same thing. Okay, it's telling me to recycle. Do I have to recycle the crystals? Can I put in a hundred? What? Oh, I did it. So that's what showed up in the dude's face. When the body all freaked out in that cutscene. Got some Cairo crystals for us? Uh-huh. These crystals only form in places with elevated Kyrillian levels. Which makes me wonder if expanding the network has something to do with it. <laughs> Damn, son. That is a lot of crystals. Maintenance and R&D will both get their fill, looks like. That's how I do, bro! I'm a crystal maniac! 420! This is awesome! <laughs> uh, Benjamin Hancock has provided design data for the following. Container re- Repair spray. Oh, yeah, I can spray containers to repair them. Exit. Oh, excess chiral crystals can be deposited in any facility that be added to stores held on site. Local stores include 
materials that you can draw upon to fabricate equipment as needed. Okay. Good work, Sam. Thanks. It seems your connection level is increasing. As your connection level increases, larger quantities of resources will be made available to you at our facilities. Big brain. Distribution center west of Capital City is afraid of following hologram data. Bridges guard macho. Gain access to a level two or higher structure and select customized structure. What? Why are you being confusing? You've been awarded the title of skilled handler. Continue to strive for greater recognition. Everyone's going to be so psyched about me. They're going to be like, yo, that's Sam, the skilled handler, a legend. <laughs> That's container repair spray for patching up cargo containers. Good for dealing with time fall degradation and all that. Useful stuff if you and your cargo have been through the ringer. We've added it to your supplies list, so it's readily available if and when you need it. Cool. Um Move to carry on back. I'll bring one of them with me. Uh, I'll offload one of the. I'll offload two PCCs. I don't think I really need them right now. Cause I'm heading out. Ah! There is a correlation between elevated Corellium levels and increased crystal formation. This may well be the result of the network's expansion. You needn't worry though, local chiral density is still within an acceptable range. If you find any more, be sure to collect it. You'll be well rewarded. If you come into more chiral crystals, you can submit them at one of our facilities. And you can deposit other resources too, along with any items you don't need. Everything has its value. What we don't use as is, can be broken down into components for R&D and other applications. Okay. Okay. The weird men have stopped talking to me now. Beginning still got work to do, Have Sam. a pleasant journey. Let's not keep people waiting. I- I know, fricker! I'm trying my best! God damn it. Okay, I'm gonna put this on my suit. I'll put it on my right shoulder, because it looks good there. Um, and container repair spray, I'm gonna put that on my hip. Nope, I keep forgetting that I have to actually confirm it. Because at least this way, any stuff that I pick up on the way always goes on my back. So I need to free up back space immediately. Alright, where is this other area I need to get to? Down here. Okay, let's let's just place a marker there. Weapons restrictions lifted. That's way further away than it looks. <laughs> it looked like it was right next to me. And then I need to go up there. Oh, BT territory. And back there is BT territory, and over there is BT territory. What? Stolen shipments home with them. Find the post box, steal back the cargo. Oh! Simple as that. But be careful. These guys are armed. If this goes sideways, be ready to fight. Dude, I have two arms! I'm twice as armed as them! Um. Oh, I can attack! Smashy, smashy! <laughs> Take that! Kick your face off. Alright, so I can put a- remove this. Remove this. Where's the other markers at? Whatever. I need to get to this. That's where the post box is. What the- Sam, now you're just slipping! Equip strands. The strands can be used to quickly and silently render enemies unconscious. What? Oh! I just like, Hleh! I can stealth them. 
You guys are gonna get garroted from the hitman. Really wish I had that bike though. That would have been Hunto epic. I get it, little menu. You can go away now. I figured it out. Okay. Do a little scan, make a little love, get down tonight. Two wheels up. What? There we go. Are there any bad boys in the area? The number of carol crystals in your possession is displayed at the bottom of your cufflinks map. Okay. Your blood level, BB stress level, yourself. Okay, what's my footwear durability? Okay, I'm not even half done yet. These boots are definitely made for walking. Okay, I'm gonna be careful anyway, because I'm scared of these guys. Postbox. Yeah, Marson Rocks! Oh, I got you over 500. I almost got you to 600 Marson Rocks. You should, you should be thankful. This isn't the one! This is a stinky one you put down! It's not my mission. My mission's all the way over there. Stinky! Big stinky post box! I'm sure it's helpful for somebody, but not for me right now. You tricked me! Okay, there's one of those scanner dudes right there. Ooh, okay. Yeah? Drop sites are rarely deserted, so remaining undetected is key. Keep a low profile smoke to minimize noise. Too late. I think they already scanned me. Okay, okay, it's fine. All I have to do is get over there to the slatter, and then I'm good. I don't know where they are. Oh, there's one. <gasps> Do I still have my strand out? Nope, that's the wrong thing. Nope! Oh, you're going down, buckaroo. Oh, I'ma get you. Oh, I'ma get you. How do I know when to do it? There you go. Yeah! <gasps> Dude, everybody was kung fu fighting! And I'm awesome! Suck it, bad man! Big stinky brain! Uh, down we go! Oh. No one is a match for Norman Reedus and his amazing fetus. Sneaky, quiet, sneaky, sneaky. Where are the bad guys? Are they around me? Dude, there's so many slatters around. Okay. I think that there might be some guys in here. Or not. Hello? It's me! Norman Reedus! Oh god! That was one! That was one! I didn't realize that! Oh! He was hidden in plain sight! Ah! Ah! Ouch! BB stress level increasing! Well, yeah. He doesn't see me. He doesn't see me. He doesn't know where I am. He doesn't know where I am. He lost me. Oh, hell yeah! They're playing some badass heavy metal music! Boom, boom, boom! Okay, we're hidden. BB, BB, it's fine. BB, it's fine. Soothe. There we go. I'm just gonna shake you around. Do I have to shake you this fast? Calm down, baby! <laughs> there you go. There you go. Nice and gently does it. There you go. There you go. BB looks happy. Okay, well, as long as BB looks happy, that's fine. 
Lads, could you not chase me? I'm a single dad. I'm trying my best. I have a bouncing baby small baby bridge boy. I can't be getting mixed up with the likes of you guys. <laughs> Jin Jin Jin! Oi! 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 <laughs> okay. Okay, so S Mule Boots and S Ladder. S Mule Boots and Sladder. Oh, it stopped. Oh, okay, good. Do I still have my strand equipped? I do. All right, what's this guy doing? Oh god, oh god, he's coming back. Oh god. Ah, uh, Slatter, stop. Perfect. Perfect time. Music, stop doing things. You're scaring me and my baby. You're scaring the children. Oh, feck. The other one's gonna see me. Everyone's gonna see me. Ooh, run, Normie! Run! Oh, he plays with a heavy metal guitar, bro! Uh oh, he's catching up to me. Uh oh. Ouch! Alright, alright, that does it. There you go. Beat him up, Norman! Kick his ass! Got your wallet! Haha, <laughs> you can't run either! Cause you're not as cool as Norman Fetus! Yes! Zoom zoom wow! Okay. Been busy? Seems all the mules in your vicinity have been incapacitated. Shut up, lethal weapon man. I had a very tough day today. I had to go up against some big bad baby boys, and I didn't like it. Whoa. Wait, is this all the stuff you- What's happening? In storage? What do I need to take? I- I don't know. Okay, return materials. I think that's it. I think those are the two. Oh, the ones with the hearts on them. Oh, okay, got it. Uh, auto arrange car. How do, what do I? How do I put them on back? Okay, carry on back. There we go. All right, good. It's a little confuso, but I'm getting there. Am I gonna get a phone call from somebody? Nice. Oh, hold on there, Normie. BB, are you doing okay? That was a tough one. Okay. Shift the weight there, Norman. Out of bite. Alright, actually, let's go down this way. This is better. This is good. It didn't go fully stealth. There was a third guy after that that I didn't see. Oh, it's you. Don't freak me out like that. Are there any cryptosporidiums around here? I wait, I want to check my orders to make sure that I got the right thing. Uh recovery chiral printer interface. Cargo recovery from a mule camp. God, there's so much stuff on screen. I I think I got what I needed. But stuff is still on the map, and it's kind of confusing me, and I don't know if it's all good. Ooh, careful, careful, careful! Norman, stop! Jesus, Norman! <laughs> I'm just gonna call you Norman. I'm never gonna call you Sam. I'm sorry. Yikes, 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 yikes! Ho, ho, ho! He just keeps running in those directions on his own. <laughs> I have very little control over what's happening. Oh, I am in a divot. Hmm. 
Norman, you absolute animal. I have made an absolute hames of this. And I've made it very difficult to accomplish our mission goals. But I got you, Norman. Wait, can I just put the stuff in here? Make delivery, deliver lost cargo. No. I can at least get rid of that. And this. I, I, I think... The materials for large scale construction. Lost cargo special device. I don't know what the special device is. I don't want to get rid of the special device. Wait, did that mean I didn't do it just now? See, this is what's confusing me. I never know what's... What I should be just delivering completely. I mean, if I sat and took time and really paid attention to the menus. But the menus are just such a clusterfuck, and I have the attention span of a potato. So... It's not disgusting, it's health and love. Oh, yikes. Oh, Normie. What are we gonna do now? We're gonna have to go this way. <laughs> what a robust lad! What an absolute machine! So turn on my fan because it's very warm in here. How you doing, Sam? I'm doing good. You're doing good? Stop talking to yourself. Says the guy who's recording a Let's Play. <laughs> well, technically right now I'm talking to myself. In my room, alone. But you're all here with me. In spirit and up here. I wasn't trying to explain that to somebody from the past. Yeah, I sit in my bedroom and I play video games and talk to people as I do it. Sounds awesome! El Grand Pato delivered to a post box near distribution center west of Capital Not City. Okay. There's a lot of terminology, there's a lot of words, there's a lot of like Capital Not Cities and bridge facility and maintenance structure and all that stuff. It gets a little confusing trying to figure out where everything is. Norman, you can run all day, and that really makes me happy. Scanning. Sam Bridges. Beginning scan. Scanning Bridges ID. Verifying ID. Clear. Web decontaminating suit. All clear. Welcome, Sam Porter Bridges. Thank you! Wait, what's this? Wait, they're PC- Why did I leave these here? What is wrong with me? I didn't even realize. Ah. Not found. What? Is that the thing I got rid of? Am I an idiot? Yes, everybody. I was an idiot. When it said in storage, it meant in the post box storage. I thought that this was like a shared storage thing. I I just didn't think. Um So this is a bunch of stuff that I can steal from this. Oh, merciful Jesus. Okay, let's- let's put it on my back for now. And then I can move it around when I get out of this menu. At least all the dudes are the- LOOK AT THIS! I'm a whole UPS van in one! Good lord. Um, alright, we can move a ladder to my suit. A PCC to my... Tool rack. Container of prayer spray. Tool rack. I need to distribute the weight. Bring it down and spread it out to get a lower center of mass. Uh, okay, that's big. Climbing anchor that can go on my suit. Another climbing anchor can go on my legs. I also need to bring him, like, back to center. Like, the- the lower he sits. Oh god. Okay, I need to get... 
Oh, it touched a boot clip. Oh, excellent. Nice one. Resins. Okay. Okay, is that good? Am I fine? I mean, I'm not fine. I look ridiculous. <laughs> okay, just keep a keep a sturdy grip on it there, Sam. <laughs> it looked like a Sherpa. Looked like I'm ready to climb Everest. Good Jesus. Maybe like the way to go. Maybe just take some of the things out of the boxes. You know, for you're talking about the world being destroyed and trying to rebuild it and everything, you sure do have a lot of waste products. It's not very eco-friendly. Alright, how do I get down this mountain without absolutely eating shit? Slowly, that's how. Slow and steady wins the race. Slow and steady, Norman Reedus's face. <sighs> Yikes. Alright there, Sam. You got it. Now this is easy. Easy. Mr. Okay, whatever. I'm too busy. I'm too busy trying not to break my ankles going down a steep cliff with 400,000 packages on my back. I can't be given likes right now. It's just over there, Sam. It's just over there, Sam. It's just over there, Sam. Okay, slow down, slow down, slow down. Shh, shh, shh. There you go. Okay. <laughs> going down hills with all this cargo. Not now! Back in the day, AI did everything. Deliveries were handled by unmanned vehicles and drones. Oh! And all we had to do was sit back and let them work. It was revolutionary. Damn near singularity. No reason for it not to take off. But it didn't. People didn't like it when we took the human element out of the service industry. So, after some consideration, we put it back in. Made jobs no one really needed and gave them the folks who couldn't live without them. And from there, it snowballed. Now we got cults of cargo chasing crazies who get off on hijacking <laughs> shipments. What? Jackal's always on the lookout for the next porter. Make sure you're not him. <laughs> oh, dude, I just can't stop stealing packages. You know how people get a runner's high? I get a cargo high. I <laughs> I love how he was like, damn, mule is addicted to cargo. It's like, what does it look like I'm doing? <laughs> We're no better. It's all a matter of perspective at this point. My Jesus. Because I even said that, like, why don't you just get drones to do it? It's like, yeah, people didn't like that, so we took it out and put the people back into it. Why? People don't like a lot of shit that happens. Beginning scan. Scanning bridges ID. Doesn't mean you buckle to it and just conform. There are other jobs. <laughs> I'm sure there's more to it. I'm sure the economics of it all and everything. I don't know. All I'm saying is that it's a pain in the ass, literally, and the back, for me to carry all this stuff all the time. But we made it, Sam! We're legends! Boom! All cargo is ready to be delivered. Order can now be completed. Okay. Here you go! I did it! Are you proud? I'm very proud. Bleep, bleep, bleep! In you go. Now I can print things here. Ah, time to get that chiral printer in working order. Sorry to push you through so much trouble, but trust me, it'll be worth it. You should be sorry. I got beaten up because Excellent. of you. The unit doesn't have a scratch on it. Never doubted you'd come through for us. I did. <laughs> It's like, I never doubted you for a second. It's like, dude, I came back without it and then had to go back and get it again. It's awesome. Sam. Yeah? How are your shoes holding up? Not too well, I imagine. Conditions being what they are out there. Nothing ruins your day like shoes falling apart while you're on the job. <laughs> Carry on like that and it's only a matter of time before you injure yourself. I've arranged for boots to be added to your supplies. Bridges standard issue, so they ought to fit you fine. You should always carry an extra pair. But if you forget or run into trouble, 
You can fabricate another by a terminal at one of our many facilities. Gotcha. You interview data acquired. Okay. Ooh, I can make a bridge. Oh, y'all know your boy's gonna make a bridge straight out of this place. It's a pain in the ass to get across that river. Bye bye. Ah! Congratulations, Sam. <laughs> I understand you now have access to a chiral printer. An extraordinarily useful device that can only function because of the manner in which our network utilizes the beach, enabling us to transfer massive volumes of data instantaneously. Since under normal circumstances, such transfers would take hours, if not days, some have speculated that the chiral network might, in essence, be a time machine. That it is transmitting data into the past. Suffice it to say, we have yet to fully grasp the fundamental nature of the network and the beach which we have come to rely upon. One might liken our relationship with it to that of primitive man's with fire. Is it useful? Quite. Is it dangerous? Undeniably so. Nevertheless, we have decided that the reward outweighs the risk. Furthermore, as the BTs are linked to the beach, it stands to reason that further study and experimentation could be of considerable benefit. The same could be said regarding you, of course. Mm. <laughs> Rest assured, I will keep you apprised of what I learn. You have my word. Thank you, Ghost Man. Good work. Wait, New so order available. it said we Access use the beach? Terminal. To transmit data? Is the beach like the cloud? Because <laughs> Amelie kept saying, I'll see you on the beach. Uh, that, that. What about the rest of the stuff? Some of it I have to recycle. Bye bye! All right, give me those likes. I get off on cargo and likes. I love delivering drugs. Claim materials. Are the okay? You say claim them. Claim materials from facility. Okay, so I'm taking the stuff that I've recycled in the facility comes back to me. All right. Let's recycle some stuff. Uh, these ones specifically. Do I have any on my back? No. Okay. That gets the stuff out of them, right? And puts it into the facility. Again, there's so many menus. And they're very confusing. Thank you. No problem, dead president, ma'am, mother. <laughs> Sweet. So now I have 1,200 resins and 1,870 metals, but I got no new crystals, which makes a lot of sense. All right, what do I have on me, though, is the thing. Okay, I have to go to the wind farm, construct bridge. I can do these, because I was going to do them anyway. It's almost like the game is designed to keep me moving in the right direction. We've added a bridge schematic to your PCC. The first step is laying the foundation, after which you'll have to supply additional materials to finish the job. Plenty of rivers and canyons could do with a good bridge, you know. Take a stroll across one you built yourself, and I guarantee you'll be glad you made the effort. Nothing like a good bridge. Give it a try. Okay, so I need 800 metals to make a bridge? Alright. Uh, confirm. Give me 200 metals? Hell yeah. Uh-oh. Okay. Okay. We might have to move some stuff around. I have 400 metals on me, so I need to move 400 metals more. Alright, so let's... Let's move you guys back to... Private Locker. For now. Because I don't have the room for you. Uh, mule boots, I'll get rid of you. I've equipped bridge boots, they're about halfway. Okay, I'll keep the other boots on me. I'm getting rid of container spray for right now, because I... I don't think I need it. I'm just gonna go build the bridge and go to the thing.
I have too much weight on me as it is. Well, I'm getting rid of this almost immediately because I need to build the bridge. Up you get some. Oh, Jesus. Mother of Christ. How much weight do I have on me? Oh, it's only 75 kilos. You carried much more. So, Jesus, Sam, your mother weighed more than that. I actually can't remember how much she weighed. How much did she weigh? Dude, that was a whole episode ago. What? Okay, Sam. Make your way to the designated construction area for the bridge. The foundation should already be in place. With your help, we'll have the thing finished in no time. Hell yeah. There be a terminal nearby. Access it to submit additional materials. Man, I thought that I got to, like, put it anywhere. I know you need to hold my hand a little to figure it out, but... I'm a big brain gamer! I was gonna pull a pro gamer move, and then you were like, no, no, no. Sam, looks like you found the site. There should be a terminal nearby. Access it to submit additional materials. It's not letting me- oh god, oh god, oh god. Jesus. Ah, okay. Complete structure. Yes. Add materials, yes. Add materials. Is that it? Yeah, metal's 800. Nice suit. Whoa. The printer of the future. I want one of these. Dun 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 It's awesome! Dude, I got so many likes for that. Bravo, Sam. That bridge should make life easier for a lot of people. Yeah, including me. Um, why do I have the power supply unit on me? I don't know. I'm gonna move some stuff around to make sure that I'm more centered. Okay, got it. I'm too lazy to go back and put it back in and then come over here again. I'm just gonna go straight to the wind farm. You just- you just want my likes, Benjamin. You're like, oh, place the bridge here, knowing full well that I would, just so you could get your likes. What is this? Rest. What? Massage shoulders. Oh, yeah. Oh. Oh, that feels good. Everyone at home, massage your shoulders right now. Oh, there's nothing quite like it. All that tension that gets built up. You wonder why you have headaches every day? It's because of that. Sleep? Sure. I'd take a little nap. Me and BB, just gonna go to sleep. Well, I didn't know he had to take off all your seat belts. Nice. What is this and why can I sleep at it? You doing good, Sam? I'm looking at you through a giant pile of shit. Oh, that's cute. Wakey wakey, eggs and bakey. I don't know if the thing you put down here, uh, Pride PSDK, allowed me to do that. Okay. But I'm gonna give you likes for it. Cause I, cause I quite enjoyed that. Oh, above 2,000. Yes. Alrighty. We move on to the wind farm and get that done. So if I get attacked and they knock stuff off my back, or if I fall over and just don't want to pick stuff up again, or we just offload something, it'll just stay in the world and other people can pick it up and bring it back. That's neat. Pick it up. Ooh, a climbing anchor. Yes, please. Oh god. Of course. BTs. I don't want to read mail. 
I am a male. Okay, we gotta get that metals. Metals are important. I have to be able to build my own bike eventually. Wait, where are the BTs? Equipment not carried in container deteriorates when Timefall touches it. Equipped tools and equipment hung from attachments will be severely affected by Timefall. Oh, like my boots! Just make everything out of plastic. If the Timefall is going to destroy everything anyway. Okay. I'm heading up this way. Well, I think so. It looked like a wind farm. I'd have to use some gear to get up there, though. <clears throat> Look at this. The lad's out in the road. Just having some crack. Having a bit of fun. Okay, I thought I might have to use a rope to get down over here. See the sun rise. The day is end. Something, something, there's no pretending. There we go. Sandalweed acquired. What the fricky does that do? Medical instrument. <clears throat> Finally, I'm not just finding drugs everywhere. What are you so happy about? No. I feel like there was no effort put into that one. I know you're happy and everything, but I'm not just gonna give you likes because the game wants me to. You gotta- you gotta be good about your likes. You can't just give away your likes to everybody. You have to keep some, so that people have to earn their likes. Just putting that happy smiley face down isn't gonna get you likes. You gotta be smart about it. Just like Dark Souls and Bloodborne. Strong wind will make movement trickier. What?! God, I have to fight rain. I have to fight wind. I have to fight rocks. Tiger Rider. Ooh. You got a lot for this one. That's good. I really should be putting down more PCC stuff. Because the game isn't out yet and I can get a lot of likes for it. Uh, yep. Yep. I want to keep that with me, actually. Ooh! Thank you. I still don't know if I should be giving away stuff to other players like that. It would also make sense that the wind is strong up here because we're he heading into a wind farm. Just put down- you should put down another locker or post box right next to that one. And see who gets more likes for it. <laughs> oh jeepers. Oh jeepers. Oh lads. Get rid of this immediately. Hello! Uh, private locker. Let's put... A device used to distribute the electricity generated by wind turbines far and wide via the car network. Okay, so I need that with me. Uh, let's store you guys. Performance enhancing beverages. Ooh. Move to private locker. <sighs> so I don't have to get rid of everything all the time and give it for other players to carry. I can just put it away in my locker and be good with it. God, these winds are strong. My character keeps turning to the right on his own. Oh, you can hold options to see the functions of a post box. I didn't try that. Man, the scenery's so cool. Everywhere you look, it just looks really nice. This is put down by the game. Wait, what does this thing do then? Upgrade structure, repair structure, and dismantle structure. I <laughs> should just dismantle the one back there. <laughs> Be an absolute ass about it. Oh, 
Smoky Smoky. I feel like these things should probably be higher up. Or actually, maybe having them in a valley is good. Oh, I'm definitely gonna have to go through BTs in here. Oh, God. I don't wanna. We're gonna have to see the thing pop out and be like, blip, blip, blip. Yep. Oh, false step. If we can get through here without any hiccups, that'll be great. Okay, slow down there, slow down there, slow down there. Ooh, I have a lot of stuff on me now, suddenly. Okay, right over there. Ooh, there's a lot of them! There's a lot of wind farm things. Turbines. I wonder if you could actually, if there are BTs in here, could I just go the whole way around and use rope equipment to get down? That'd be neat. If you could just- If you prepped well enough, you could just completely avoid certain scenarios. Yikes, 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 yikes! Ooh, surfer boy. What's happening? What was that sound? Yep. Here we go. <sighs> Every time with this animation, really. I want one of those things in real life. It looks cool. Like a fully functioning one. Okay, I'm gonna drink my cantina. Because it's gonna fill up again anyway. And I need all the stamina I can get for this section. Oof, okay. This actually gets super tense. Okay, where are you pointing me? Over there. Jesus. I have too much on me. Oh god, oh god. No, where are you going, Sam? He's too heavy. He's too heavy. Hold your breath. Oh god. Oh god. Oh god. It was right above me. Oh, I'm gonna get dragged. I don't have the stamina for this. I'm carrying way too much for this shit. Okay, keep holding your breath. Don't pick up anything else. Else. Extra. Else and extra together. Okay. BT territory sucks. BT stands for bad territory. Okay, take it nice and easy. God, it's still miles away. Can't believe I'm actually dodging them. The first time I did this, it felt like I wasn't able to dodge them at all. Or maybe I was supposed to get caught in that scenario. I'm not sure. God, 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 this sucks. Oh god, oh god, okay, I'm fucked. I am fucked. Jesus! Yee! Yee! Get off! Get off, get off, get off, get off, get off, get off! Shit. Shit. Can I even get away? Is it even possible? It is! Go, go, go! 
Go, Sam! Oh my god. Holy shit. Holy shit, I actually did it. Oh, baby. Okay, I'm not going back for that cargo. Not yet. I was carrying way too much already. Oh, wait, unless they got the fucking thing I need. No, I still have the power supply unit. Good. Okay, good. Oh, boy. I kind of figured out the mechanic for it a bit better then. <laughs> he poked me on the shoulder and went like that. I realized that you have to shake them and then it tells you to grip, but you just need to grip for a second and then start shaking again. And then you're good. So can they not get past the chiral network? I don't know. I also need to fix my boots. Oh, get rid of this shit! Nice. Get that power up and going again, lads. Delivering cargo. Thank you. With this unit, we should be able to power the distro center via the chiral network. Other places too, if it works. Here's hoping the UCA can put our electricity to good use. Here's hoping. Mind if I have a look? Uh. Incredible. How'd you get this here? You fly? I wish. Can you fly in this game? <laughs> it's awesome! <laughs> Such a good delivery boy! Seriously, give me some pizzas. I'll get them to you on time, hot, fresh, oh, and ready. Now's a connection to the chiral network. Just call me Papa Go John. I think some of the stuff here is like equations for time travel. Or not time travel, for black holes. Yeah, <laughs> you. Maybe there is some time travel stuff going on. There's definitely at least interdimensional stuff going on. Bandwidth is a limited resource, and every structure you build consumes it. However, as you increase your connection level, the bandwidth available to you will increase as well. Sweet. So I have 450 bandwidth used out of 3,000. Sick. Look at that. Look at America grow. I kind of wish they used a different location than America. Not that I have anything against America. It's just that having it be a specific place. Like, I don't have- not being from America, it, it, I don't have like a strong connection to that. So, fixing America isn't something that I'm like super invested in. Fixing humanity, yes. And that's why I think if you did a fictional place, it kind of transcends locations then. And then everybody can just relate to it more. Just as people. But limiting it to America will either increase your likeness and your attachment rate to the, the cause, or it'll decrease your attachment rate to the cause. Some people just won't care about rebuilding America. If you get my- if you get my drifty. Look at all that. Look at all that badness I came across. Okay, did I say I could make a power generator? Thanks again. No problem. You know, I heard the rest of your team was wiped out. Makes what you're doing all the more incredible. You're a one-man expedition. I hope Amelie's doing as well as you. Wonder if she made it to Edge Not City yet. It was her that put us in charge of the wind farm. I was with the group bringing up the rear while Amelie led the way. I've never met her in person. But it was an honor to travel with her all the same. When you see her, feel free to tell her I said so, huh? Ah! Sam, got a moment? Sure. I ran an experiment with your blood. It seems you were onto something. After dispersing an aerosolized sample of your blood in BT territory, we observed reduced activity. Mm. While this is hardly definitive as we have no other repatriates, 
to whom we can turn for additional testing, it does suggest that the bodily fluids of repatriates are repellent to BTs. Interesting. Mama had the idea of developing a weapon to test this. Give me blood grenades. The prototype should be ready soon. And when it is, we'd like you to test it. Give me blood mace. Ah! Sam, <laughs> this is the perfect opportunity. We've almost got the whole region on the Cairo network. All that's left is Port Knot City. Return to Capital Knot City so you can pick up relief supplies for Port Knot. By the time you arrive, we can give you the completed prototype in person. One other thing. It's not very often porters get out to that wind farm. While you're there, you should pick up any outstanding orders. No sense coming all the way back here empty-handed if there's work to be done. Have a look at that delivery terminal. Wait, I have to come all the way back Good to work. you guys? New order available. Please access delivery term. What the frick? Congrats, Sam. You're cleared to take on open orders. Thanks, Mama. While they're not as high priority as the ones specifically assigned to you, if you're already heading a certain way and you have room to spare, it couldn't hurt to do a little more, right? Just because they're not mission critical doesn't mean they're not important to someone. So why not do a good deed or two? Uh, yeah, it could hurt. I get attacked all the time and almost die. My feet hurt. I'm climbing all over these really sharp rocks. You people. Uh, okay, I have to go back that way anyway. God, I have to go all the way back to the original location I came from. That wind farm you've brought into the network is essential for our continued expansion. By way of reward, I've added a little something to your PCC. A generator option. Ooh, okay. Generators recharge the batteries of all nearby devices. That includes machines, bikes, and other battery-powered vehicles. Now I get it. So if I... I can build the generator back here to redo the bike and then bring the bike all the way back. Okay, so it's not that bad. Um... Cool. Oh, it's sweet Jesus. Mother of Christ! Wait, why am I bringing all this? Did I load everything when I shouldn't have? Play some private locker. No, I could just... Well, I could actually. Place all the resins in my private locker and then just recycle them when I'm back at the other place. Oh, that's so much better. I think there's something in there that I didn't get that I keep loading all of the gear onto me. For no reason. Oh, I have to go back through BT territory! Bad territory! Oh, I need- okay. I need to bring those. I'll just get them from my locker somewhere else. I don't need to bring them all the way back here with me right now. Alright, I'm going... over deal. Ah, oh, that's good. Because you... <laughs> you made it through the territory, so you made a happy face. I'm gonna put down... Wait, is it still bad? So many signs everywhere. I can't just give likes to everything for no reason. The BTs are gone, right? It means that I can pick up the cargo that I I dropped and lost. Yeah, I think this is my one. It's the medical device that I lost. God, I'm already at 57 kilos. That's a lot! Did I lose health? Oh, rest. I don't need rest right now. Eat one of these bad boys! Need to grab more crystals along the way. On the road again. I can't wait to be on the road again. Oh no, this is a medical instrument as well. I think this is my one. Oh, 
Oh god. These are very heavy. Also, those trees sound super creepy. Alright, just get back to your buddies back at this place. Hey Sam, you could probably get that bike running again if you charged it with a generator. That's my plan! Why not give it a try? I'm gonna! Give me a sec. I've only just gotten back, my footwear's almost ruined, I fell down the cliff. But I'm here, I'm alive. Also, it says weapons usage restricted. Does that mean we're gonna get weapons eventually? Because I'm excited about that. Uh, post box, no. Bridge foundation, no. Watchtower, no. Generator, yeah. Sorry, Sam. I can't allow you to build a structure there. Pick a spot outside the sensor ring and try again. Shut up. <laughs> there we go. Please, please charge that bike. Yeah? How big is this thing? Jeepers. That's a little wind turbine. That's cool. Construction complete. Yes! Whoa! That charges it fast! Yes! Use vehicle. Oh, it's all rusted though. Oh, this is so much better. Now we're riding in style. Hell yeah. Okay, I'm gonna take that bad boy out on the road trip. But for now, I need to get rid of some items. I have some stuff on me. No longer move once this is depleted. Your ability is restored by storing a vehicle in the garage. To store a vehicle, park it on top of the vehicle elevator. Ooh! There's a vehicle elevator?! In Death Stranding? With Norman Fetus and the amazing Reedus? I don't know where the vehicle... Is it down here? <laughs> this isn't it, is it? I don't know. Maybe it's one of these? No, no access. So store a vehicle, park it on top of the vehicle elevator. Oh! Oh, okay, this is it. It just didn't do anything yet. Maybe it'll be repaired if I do something else. Okay, make a delivery. Requested cargo. See, I kept this. Oh. No, I don't have it. Oh yeah, wait, 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 wait. This is the one where I need all the resins. Hold on a sec. Let me go to my private locker. Good lord. Where's all my resins? Is it the private locker just back at that place and not shared? Oh, tits! Oh, that's so annoying. I thought the private lockers were just shared everywhere. Oh, no, I have to go back and get it and then bring it back here. Okay. Nice! There it is. My little trike. Can you do anything with it? Store vehicle. Now it's in the garage. Aces! Goodbye, little trikey! It's gonna come back brand new. Alright, folks. Well, I'm gonna leave this episode of Norman Reedus and the Amazing Fetus here. That was an interesting one. We, we learned a lot more mechanics, we learned more how the mission structure works, we learned how to build a bunch of stuff. I feel like we get some good progress. I like these longer episodes because it feels like I'm actually getting stuff done. If these- could you imagine doing a regular Let's Play of like a half hour to an hour of this? You get nothing done. Jeez, remember years ago when you'd upload 
8 to 12 minute episodes of a Let's Play, and that was fine. Games have gotten so long since then. <laughs> but for me, and my beautiful, bouncy baby boy, we're gonna have to wave bye-bye. Say bye-bye! Bye-bye.